Good evening. Thanks for joining us. I'm Beth Farnsworth. And I'm CJ Ward. We begin at 6 o'clock with a chaotic St. Patrick's Day weekend in San Luis Obispo. Thousands of Cal Poly students and visitors filled the streets, causing damage on and around campus. And News Channel reporter Tony Almanza joins us live. Tony, the Cal Poly president says that he is disgusted by some students' behavior. That's right, Beth and CJ. A TikTok video shows someone doing pull-ups on a power line. St. Freddy videos shot in San Luis Obispo are going viral online. Video shows massive street parties that took place on and near campus. One video shows thousands of dollars in damages to school property. I just saw a lot of commotion in the dorms very early on. Uh, I didn't make it out to the street because I had practice in the morning, but I did see a lot of motion in the dorms and a lot of destruction. University officials had to shut down some student housing and evacuate about 300 students for safety repairs. The Cal Poly president released a statement saying he is disappointed and disgusted by the behavior of some students and visitors. Yeah, I feel like the crowd was kind of like an unmovable force, so I don't know how much they could have done. But yeah, I feel like they did as best as they could. Damage includes broken ceilings, theft from campus stores, and nearby cars were broken into. I'm not totally sure, but I think they probably were out till like 11 a.m., 12 a.m., and then everyone was probably pretty, pretty tired at that point because I think everybody woke up at like 3. Slow police say it was a very busy weekend and there were no serious injuries or deaths. I felt, I, I personally had a really good squad. Um, we are all like, yeah, just really, I, I felt safe. Yeah, I've, I was with a group of guys, so I felt safe too. More info will come from Slow PD, PD this week, and we will keep you updated. Live at Cal Poly, I'm News Channel reporter Tony Almanza.